Today, Kansas Governor Laura Ke uh, Kelly rather extended a stay at home order until May 3rd. She said this was done in collaboration with Missouri Governor Mike Parson, but Governor Parson did not extend Missouri's order today. So the current order in Missouri expires one week from Friday. And in Missouri, a growing number of self-employed people who lost their jobs are now hitting roadblocks when filing for unemployment insurance. A hairstylist tells us she's tried filing for unemployment three times, but keeps getting denied for insufficient wage claims. This week, she applied again, but was told she's not eligible to file again until after July 4th. That's terrifying to me because I still have to come up with this money regardless of if I'm getting unemployment or not. My biggest fear is those bills stacking up and what is going to happen afterwards. And we found the website for the state's Department of Labor is not equipped to allow people who are self-employed to apply for what's called pandemic unemployment assistance, at least not yet. Missouri's Labor Department announced today that it does want them to apply for unemployment. Self-employed claims will start being processed sometime next week. And, you know, Ellen, it's not just Missourians having issues with unemployment as well, because we've also been on top of this growing problem for people in Kansas as well. Yeah, that's right, Brad. And the State Department of Labor's IT team has been struggling with higher traffic. People are on the phones and they're taking millions of calls. When calls first started coming in, they only had 20 people working the phones. But now Governor Kelly tells us there are 150. On Tuesday alone, get this, they received about 751,000 calls. The Labor Department is taking more steps to help people out. We're trying to figure out exactly what's being done. Governor Kelly did say today that there will be an official announcement tomorrow about what the Department of Labor is doing.